Hey everyone, it's Petlover997 here. Haven't done a video of this tank in a while. <clears throat> um, sorry for the little bit of glare and stuff, but I haven't showed you guys this tank in over like three months. I mean, lots of things have changed. You can tell that the scape, everything's changed in this tank. Uh, substrate is real substrate now. It's a fluoride substrate, the red one, the red and black one. So. That changed, um, the whole thing changed. I still have some of the plants that I had from before. They're doing good. Um, fish wise, uh, new fish here and there, some emperor tetras, uh, some cardinals. Uh, yeah, that's about it. But lots of things have changed. I added a piece of driftwood, some moss, so that this whole area could be covered in moss. Um, let me just get closer. Uh, this is here some Reneki, which been, has been doing great. I actually bought the immersed version of this, and it was really small, like on the on the floor. But now it it's growing beautifully. Rotala doing awesome. Over here, some Ludwigia. Yeah, I think you've got seed Ludwigia before. They're doing great. I just did a water chain, so everything's purling and stuff. Uh, there's some Rotala Vietnam. It it looked better before but I had an algae eater which completely finished it up and so I had to get rid of the algae eater and now it's actually growing back those nice red tops angels been doing great these guys are still here uh, back there is some kabamba hornwort mix over there uh, so there's some uh, lava rocks here and there here's some uh, stargy and repens they're actually really nice because I only got like, I don't know, like three pieces and look at them now. It's a, it's a mini carpet. Some Blixa Japonica, doing good. A little small on the side. They're always getting uh, picked at for some reason. Over there is some uh, Sunset Hygro, which has also been, what is that? Sunset Hygro, which has also been doing good. Because I only got like one piece and now it's actually turning into a lot and yeah that's the tank right now the 29 gallon which you guys haven't seen in a really long time it's doing great it's doing great everything's doing great um, I'm gonna think about upgrading some of the stuff in this tank first of all DIY CO2 is gonna most probably turn into real CO2 and maybe I'm going to get a new light maybe a uh, phoenix ray 2 or a planted plus i think i might go for the ray 2 cuz i hear the ray 2 is stronger than planted plus but yeah my angel still no successful breeding going on i mean they lay the eggs but then they eat it in a few days Alright, so let me show you guys my uh, shrimp tank right now. So the shrimp tank's been doing pretty good. Uh, babies, they're growing up. As you can see that one's almost adult size. A lot of them are getting to their adult ages now. Uh, the moss, what I did with the moss is I just laid it all out. I wanted to get into like a carpet and keep that driftwood right nicely in the middle. And yeah, that's what's been going on in the shrimp tank. It's been doing pretty good. Um, a really weird founding had happened. If you can see, yeah, there's two baby fry in here. I don't know where they came from. They must have traveled with the moss or something. These are Emperor Tetra um, babies, I think. They're looking like Emperor Tetras, which I have in my 29 gallon. And this piece of driftwood was in my 29 gallon before. So these guys must have came from there. And yeah, I'm just letting them grow out in here until they're like a little bit bigger and then they'll go in my 29 gallon with their mother and father. So yeah, it's a pretty weird finding, but I mean, it looks pretty cool. Little fish in here actually looks pretty cool. If I do get any like 
like uh, babies next time of tetras or any kind I might just put them in here they look really good I don't know where they just went yeah yeah so yeah it was weird finding I just found them one day just swimming around a little I'm like what is that it doesn't look like a shrimp and yeah so it's a fish two of them actually it's cool nice finding all right guys thanks for uh, watching